George Washington is in the lobby. But room six isn't ready. It still has chickens and a farmer in it. I'd love a different room. Cheap, cheap. But the chickens won't budge. We can't keep George Washington waiting. George, George Washington! Washington. Doodle ho, bellhops. I'm ready to head to room six. So, uh, it has to be room six? Six is at the end of my favorite number, 1776. But mostly, I love that room six is so clean. Well... Not so much as a feather. Uh... Oh! it up. George Washington is heading straight towards a room filled with 100 chickens. I am totally freaking out. Cat's right. I should just stay calm and count the floors. First, second, third, fourth, fifth floor. That's it, you leaning on George Washington's favorite number, Cat. Sixth floor. Huh? I'll slip in there as you give George the key to his room. And take your time. Okay, so George Washington, how about a key that says six plus zero or five plus one? They both equal six. Cheep, 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 cheep. The chickens won't budge. They can totally stay if they stay in a certain position. Get in a certain position, chickens. Uh, what position? Well, John and my a 1776 made of chickens. Room six is even better. And so... Problem solved. The problem is solved. The bellhop solved the problem. Everything is awesome. Problem solved. I'm stuck on top of the Washington Monument. Hop, two, three, four, hop. Now the parade's heading this way. Everybody's going to see the vice president and me. We've got to get him down. Onto my shoulders. Onto your tippy toes. Onto your tippy toes on my tippy nose. Not even close. We'll never reach that super high height. I am really embarrassed. Madam President? Pictures of me stuck up here will be on newspapers and TV screens around the world. No one will ever respect me again. I respect you even more. Huh? You got stuck up there because you were taking a really brave risk. Which backfired. That happens when you take risks. Cat and I embarrass ourselves every day. Some days twice. If you're going to solve big problems, you gotta take big risks. So instead of feeling embarrassed, keep right on going. After we count backward from five and calm down. Five, four, three, two, one. That's it, you lying down genius. Huh? Height standing up is the same as length lying down. So if we... Make the rubber band into a lasso, toss it around the monument, and get the bottom truck driving, You guys are amazing! 170 meters of height becomes 170 meters of length! Oh, oh, not too fast. Oh, oh careful! Ah! Because we know about height and length, we're rescuing the leaders of the free world! Math can save your nation from humiliation! And so... Problem solved! The problem is solved! We solve the problem. So everything, everything is awesome. Is problem of national importance. Now who's going to take charge of these chickens while I'm gone? Right here. Not so fast, Peggy. Anybody else want the job? <laughs> the pig? He's only standing there because he's too lazy to walk away. Pig, do you want to be in charge of the chickens? I never seen him so excited. You can't both be in charge. So let's have an election. But isn't it an election where people choose who they want to be in charge by voting? People or <laughs> chickens? Chickens, who'd you rather have in charge? Peg or the pig? Just sit by either picture to vote for who you want. One, two, three, four votes for me. One, two, three, four, five for the pig. Four is less than five, so the pig is winning. Come on, chickens, vote for me. 
Why are they just sitting there? Oh, the chickens always take their time deciding who to vote for. They've had elections before. Check out some of their past leaders. Oh, they got Ramon. But they've always wanted to elect someone who lives on the farm. The pig lives on the farm, so he has a way better chance of winning. We've got a really big problem. But I'm not That's the way we do. So be sure then vote for more than vote for hey. If he's offering two snacks, I'll offer seven. If he offers ten, then I'll offer eleven. Just ask your fellow chick. It's plain arithmetic. So be sure. Sure, then vote for more.